Good. How are you, Awesome. I'm doing very well. Um, so I'm going to make a very quick intro, make sure that everybody is aware of what's going on, and then I'll just hand it over to you all. So uh, let's get this thing started. This is the Rose AMA number two. All four of the members are in the same physical room today, so we shouldn't run into any audio issues. Um, I'm the host. My name is Kim, and I'm going to uh, be facilitating this AMA. Um, for those of you that are new that don't know what an AMA is, an AMA is an Ask Me Anything. It's essentially a uh, virtual Q&A session where I pose questions that have been previously curated, and the Rose answers the questions. And today we're going to switch it up a little bit. Every question that I ask is directed at every single member, so we want to make sure that everybody is equal, everybody uh, gets a little slice of the pie here. So. Um, the Rose will be doing an intro. I know that you all want to hear the Rose. They're finally back together. Drop some roses in the chat. Drop some rose emojis. Make sure that you show them so, so much love today for giving us their time. Uh, they're finally back together. Uh, so instead of me doing the intro, like for AMA number one, I told the Rose that they need to do the intro themselves and show you guys some love. So uh, without further ado, this is the Rose, and I will jump out, and then when they are finished with their super awesome announcement that we've been hyping up for a while in here, uh, then I'll hop back in and we'll start the Q&A session. So show some love for the Rose, and I will see you guys very soon. All right. Pass it on. Pass on. Inza, I'm going to give you a hand. Oh, my God. Okay. 인사드렸습니다. 둘, 셋. 안녕하세요. 반갑습니다. 오, 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 um, we're looking at the chat right now, and so many people are excited. The chat's going so fast. It is. Yeah, I think it lagged, maybe. Mm. But um, we're here today. We have a couple of things we want to talk to you guys about. A couple of very important announcements. Yay. Um, and we definitely wanted to do it first here on Discord. Mm -hmm. It's our new fan cafe. And mm -hmm. It's where all our community is. So. Yeah. Um, yeah, I don't, uh, how should we get started? We should talk about how we were before though, like how, what we were doing, how we are, mm -hmm. uh, well, as, yeah. as you, you guys could have, um, like recognized, Sammy came to Korea. Yeah. And we spent good time. Good mm -hmm. times. Um, and some of you might already know that, uh, through, through IG thing. The, the live we had a great I, night yes yeah um maybe too great i kind of regret going live uh, <laughs> i was too drunk yeah me too anyway and the day after uh we we went for um, um a team work um camp. vacation team vacation yeah. okay clamping clamping and we talked about how you know how we we were doing. Yeah. So we'll update you on how we were doing. Um, Hajun, how, how are you doing? Um. <laughs> recently, um, I was, you know, just work, worked out. Working out. Yeah, working out. Mm -hmm. And then, um, I prepared my fitness shot. Ooh. Ooh. Body shape, right? Yeah, or, body shape. What's called? Yeah. Yeah. Body so, profile. Yeah. So I I just finished that, and when's the pictures gonna come out? Um, actually, I have it. I I have them, but I have a plan uh -huh. to upload some videos wow. on my YouTube. Oh. Oh. So everybody look forward to that as well. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I saw the pictures actually. They are very spicy. And, <laughs> and and we saw it not on not just the picture, like really, like the yeah. physical <laughs> real, real body and I even touched it. Yeah, me too. It was very uh, hard. hard. Yeah. <laughs> well Okay, what about you? Jeff. 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 Me? Yeah. Um 
uh, this is um similar. I'm working out, and I'm I'm learning English. Oh, Yeah, it's so so hard. hard. Yeah, if you go to English class like twice a week, three times a week. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's so hard, and um, yeah, this is, I got in, I got into golf, <laughs> and uh, I got Dylan into golf too. Yeah. 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 Uh, we we actually after our uh, little trip, we actually all went to screen golf because uh, Jeff insisted that golf was fun, and we spent like four hours playing this one game, and I honestly didn't think it was that fun. <laughs> um, <laughs> but 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 I can see why people play. Leo's a good golfer, actually. Yeah. He's been golfing for a while, right, Leo? Okay. Okay. Oh, I'll accept that. Leo's the best golfer, but then Jeff, uh, I think he it's his new hobby, so he's been uh, getting into it very, very like heavily. He's a he's a quick yeah. learner. He he learns really quick and he's now really good at it now. Yeah, I can I can assure that. Yeah. yeah. So I think when we go on tours now, we might have to hit up some golf courses. <laughs> Just for Jeff. Ooh, nice. Yeah. Hmm. And then um What about you, Leo? Yeah, basically for me too. Like um, I've been working out just um, like I said before on the first um AMA session, we were just um concentrating on our um well being, like health, and just like you know, getting ready for our comeback. Well, yeah, and waiting for you, yeah, guys, <laughs> to come and realign. Yes. And yeah, and we are reunited. Yay. Well, yeah. Anyway, so like I said before, we 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 gather around and we had like our um um teamwork time and like you know family time like you know as in as in group any anyway um and we even talked about our future um you know yeah um future music or future albums uh, what we should like you know what we were thinking about or what we should do with it you know mm -hmm. and I think we had a good conversation. And we had a good idea, like, popping up. Yeah. We actually, uh, we got together, and the main point of us uh, getting together was our, just to get, just to realign on everything, like Leo said, and just to see where everybody was at. Mm. Um, it was, uh, the four of us being together, it's been, like, what, two and a half years? Yeah. So, um, we talked about a lot of things. We talked about our personal lives. Mm. We talked about what we went through, our experiences. And we definitely talked about the future of The Rose and what kind of music or what kind of um, message we want to portray um, to you guys, basically. And we wanted to do this AMA session. It's not really an AMA. It's a more of an announcement. However, uh, we wanted to kind of talk about where our head's at um, in terms of our album that's going to come out this year. Um, so the new songs like what what's our messaging like and we want to really be able to involve you guys in the process of this whole thing mm, yeah and, and talk about it yeah yeah like you know um as you guys would know that we not us not only us for all of us like yeah. the, the globe actually went a lot of hardship you know you know there there was a, like um 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 Before like, before that, mm -hmm. if, can we okay? If if you could guess the album name right now before we say it, because oh, we're gonna a, drop our album name right now at this moment in a few minutes. So oh, wow, it's a quiz. Oh, actually, never mind. We we named we it. We're ready. Uh, yeah, I know. We're ready. <laughs> I was like, there. <laughs> every, every <laughs> no. I was like, what the heck? But it is really live. Like it's it's oh, yeah. genius. No, they all okay. Never mind. Okay. Okay. Send me. Send me. Send me some. Sorry. Go mm. <laughs> ahead. Oh, so yeah. So we've been, you know, we had a lot of hardship, all of us, not only us four, all around the world. Yeah. And we were talking about how individuals and all the world was going on. And that's when we, like, the, 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 the title of this H E A L <laughs> came up. Like, that's how it, it yeah. came up. Well, it, it Honestly, from the beginning, if you've been following us from our debut, um, 
you know that our message basically was always just healing together mm -hmm. and through our music we always talked about how writing music and also listening to music could heal um in many different ways and many different situations uh that we just go through as human beings and uh with that uh with that, with the rows coming back together, we really wanted to get into our main, like, first message that we had as a band. Um, we really wanted to talk about uh, things we went through personally, maybe things you guys went through, mm. and maybe things that other people went through, and, and have that message of just healing together. And that's why we decided to call it Heal. Uh, I, think, I think this world these days, in this modern life, in our life, we have a, a lot of people need healing, and we might not even know that we need it. So uh, that's the message we really want to portray and talk about. And today, uh, with that message, we definitely have certain things that we want to talk to you guys about and include you guys in the process of writing this album. Yes. Yes. And this was an idea that came up recently when we were talking um together when us four got together and it, it's really we're, we're we're still building the idea mm -hmm. um but we do want to present it to you guys first and then kind of go through go through with it together yeah yeah so jeff will you tell us uh, tell them the idea what the idea is it can be really slow like you Take know your time. just words because it it will say everything <laughs> mm. What? Uh, that we are going to involve in this project. We are going to we always think um, music is healing and the ethnic all of us and all of you guys everyone need to heal need healing and the, and the, we thought that we want the story of you guys like um, when we writing when when you wrote the lyrics, we need some stories and we have to write the healing song. We need your stories. So basically the point is this. Yeah. So he just said it. We need your um, stories and your thoughts and your um, experiences. Yeah. And we just wanted to talk about it first. Yeah. And we just wanted to hear your um, yeah, stories. Yeah, so basically, whatever you're going through at this moment, mm -hmm. or in the past, or whatever you are, wherever you're at in your life, um, we want to receive your guys' story. And with those stories, uh, we want to be able to kind of create this album together and write songs together, in a way. And um, yeah, that's, that's basically it. Uh, we have our stories that we definitely want to talk about. Already, yes. Okay. Yes. Uh, Jeff? actually has his story that he wants to talk about individually as well. However, um, we want to hear your story because this album is going to be just for us. For, for us. us. And for us. The <laughs> Rose and Black Rose. Yes. yes. Mm. And then, so Hajin, what are, uh, where can they submit the stories? そう、そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そう。そ
and your location where you're living at because 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 uh -huh. because we need that information mm. no because <laughs> No, because <laughs> by the location, because uh, we want this is just a very Random. very rough idea right now. Yeah, but we want to be able to pick stories and the one like for example, if if you guys wrote us like one full story and we really related with the story mm. and we really do end up writing a song about the story, we want to be able to fly you guys out, fly this person out with the story. And maybe spend the day together. I don't exactly know what we would do. Mm -hmm. um, we want to like, think about it a little more. But wherever you're at in the world, we will fly to you. Or maybe we'll fly you out to us. Mm -hmm. And we'll spend the day together. We'll film it all. Mm -hmm. And um, the idea is that we will share your story. Mm -hmm. And we will talk about your story. And by then, we would most likely have a song with your story. Yeah. So, um yeah. Well, yeah. You know, yeah. you know how like really private and personal story can be really universal. Mm -hmm. You know, you know how it could be really um like general in in a in different way. Yeah. So I we want that to be really captured in that song. Yeah. And I think by doing this, we we are really excited and what we could really have a great um message mm. throughout the whole album and we are really excited for this yeah we were actually talking about this like no matter how specific the story is mm. it's okay because um for example if you read books no even if it's a book about wizards even if it's a book about fantasy world you still find messages in that story that fits with you or as a lesson you learn um, within that story, so mm -hmm. it's okay. Uh, uh, get spe as specific as you want with your own story. Mm -hmm. uh, please don't uh, make it up though. <laughs> Over exaggerating maybe, but making it up like totally. Uh, we're we're gonna fact check. Mm -hmm. um, so please do not do that. Okay. <laughs> so uh, write, don't write a novel. Yeah, please don't write a. Uh, actually, maybe if if it's good enough, maybe we'll buy it. I like that. <laughs> If you could fool us, then do it. But if you cannot, please don't do it. Because, you know, we, we're actually going to meet this person. Yeah. And then we're going to talk about it. But if you make if you made this the, the thing hold up, then it will be probably, like, um, weird. Yes. <laughs> and then also, for the heel chat room that we have for you guys, mm -hmm. uh, it's not a talking room, guys. Uh, write your stories, not hi. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we, want, we want long paragraph <laughs> stories here. So then we could really like uh, manage to read them, um, not just see uh, you guys engaging here. We could engage somewhere else, like the general chat, Tojun chat, Hajun chat, Taehyung chat, you know. There's Tojun many chat. places we could uh, engage. Yeah. But the heel mainly is for your stories. The full content. Yeah. But if everybody just uh, puts emojis on here, then it's going to be hard for us to really find the stories. And so please. Okay. I trust that you guys will have that um, sense. Yes. <laughs> we'll, we'll be sure to clean it up uh, after this AMA. I'm, I'll make an announcement. Make sure to clean it up uh, for sure. Great. Okay. Yeah. So, well, basically, this is the main announcement that we wanted to um, um, announce. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, no. And... And uh, we are so excited about this and we want to um, really read your stories, your trauma, your experiences, all of, it could be anything. So we're really um, looking forward to this. Yes. Yes. And then uh, with this, um, you know, we're writing songs right now. That's why um, I'm in Korea. That's why I came here. And then, like we said before, uh, we're going to spend some time here in Korea. We're going to fly back to America, finish the album, mm. um, finish the songs we're writing. So, yeah, we definitely need the stories now. So then we could really go into the studio and think about how to write the song or how we could incorporate these stories into the song. So, yeah. Sounds good? Sounds good. Yes. And, and, and I was reading the um, chat, chat, the chat room, and I think our fans are excited too. Is, is this right? Is, yeah. is it right? Okay. They look very, so uh, many questions here. Okay, deadline. Yeah. Deadline, uh, hmm. 
deadline. Uh, before well, what is today? Before August first. Actually, that's a little late. Maybe. Yeah, very late. Let's make it before like. Let's just set a date. Ju July. July house. Oh, seventh house. Seventh. A uh, seventh oh. of July. Like seventh of. That's seventh. Too too early, no? Yes. Yeah. Well, well, we have three actually, weeks. Oh yeah, you're right. You're right. Okay, July seventh. No, uh, July first then. Ooh. Yeah. We'll just make it clean. July first. July first. Yeah. Then they'll have two weeks to write. That's. Is that is that enough, guys? <laughs> we'll see July. Dude, uh, I can't even read this. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, the first of July is perfect, okay. they say. Okay, and... cool. Okay. Okay, so then, okay, can we mark that in our calendar? Um, July 1st is the end of submission for the Heal Project for your stories. Um, like we said, uh, please write your name, your age, and where you're living currently, your location. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's the three information we definitely need. Um, yeah. Okay. I love the process. How you know setting up the date like all together. Yeah. You yeah. know this is like we're figuring it out as we go. And with you guys is the point. Um, they're saying just a city or full. Location. Well, we don't want your full address. <laughs> <laughs> However, like yeah, tell yeah. us like if you're if you're in Korea, uh, be like Korea Seoul or like Korea like Busan. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Mm -hmm. if like, you're in California, yeah. like California LA. LA. Something like that. Summer, something like that. Yeah. Okay. Well, nice. Okay. Um. Well, I think um for the announcement we could. Yeah, we have a couple of questions wrap up. coming up. Okay. Uh, then let's the, have the... let's have the questions for this heel for yeah. about like um five minutes or something. Cool. Okay. Because like, there'll be. Confused, and if okay. if we could be specific, it will be better for them to write. So yeah. okay, we're figuring it out as we go um, together. So we're not even sure, but and um after this announcement, I think it 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 will be better for our fans to have the um um the explanation or or how oh, we yeah, want we'll it. So we we'll, we'll have that info written on the Discord channel. So. Um, read that before you write. What if I'm underage? Like, what does that what, have to like, do with like underage? Like how? How much? I mean, I would, that doesn't um, matter. The age requirements will be eighteen plus uh, per the team uh, team okay. message just now. So if you are eighteen plus, you can access the channel and share your story per uh, James. Okay. Oh, well, wait, you can. Oh really? Oh really? Per James, as in, as in like pro. Yeah, uh, so we want to we want to keep it safe for everybody that is under eighteen. So we're going to gate the channel to eighteen plus, and then you can share the story to avoid any issues. Oh, true, true, true. We do if yeah. we do want to change that up, that's totally fine. Uh, just I think, I think it well, what about this? I think in terms of the story itself, we we'll talk about it within within our team as well. But uh, I think our initial thought is that anyone should be able to submit. Yes. Um, and if the traveling is an issue, we'll go to them. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and, and you know we'll figure out a way. But I think anybody should be able to uh, write their stories. I, I don't think we should have an age limit or any any sort of limit. Yes. As please. long as you can um speak and contrary your I mean. <laughs> or write, you mean? Or write? Yeah, what, it, yeah, it doesn't matter. As long as you can... Yeah, we'll, like, we'll we take out your age restriction. Yeah, yeah, your thoughts, that's that's cool with us. Yeah. Yes, yes. Let's do that. Mm, nice. Yeah, uh, yeah, of course, of course. Yeah. Black okay. roses are uh, from age 0 to like 1,000, so... Like, Let's do we that. We can't limit it. Mm -hmm. um, what else? What else? Some questions for you. The project. Yeah. Any questions? Um, um, one or two. What kind of stories? What kind of stories? Yeah. Mm. Any kinds of stories that you feel like you. Well, okay. For example, right? If you feel like there was a situation that healed you and that uh, really inspired you, that could be a story. Mm -hmm. If you feel like you need some healing with certain, let's say, oh, oh my, uh, you know, this, this, and this happened. And this and this I'm traumatized by. I need a little bit of healing. Mm -hmm. Like I don't know how to get over it. I don't know how to uh, feel okay. Like that's okay too. Anything goes. But the main message, main theme is that we want to heal together. Whatever you're going through, whatever your story might be, um, at the time of your life, we will 
heal together. Like sharing it sometimes, uh, like for example, when we write lyrics, right? And when we write about things we go through, when we have it out on paper, it really heals us. So maybe it could do, th do that for you as well when you write your own story and you see it at laid out. Um, so yeah. Yeah you, Please, anything. yeah, you know how, like, when we were kids, like, especially, like, um, um, junior high, senior high, like, intermediate, when, when you listen to the music, you, um, you look at the lyrics a lot, so that, um, that and you listen to a song where, uh, where your situation is the same, or, like, similar to where you are at, you know, and you get really healed by listening to it, just by listening, or just, like, getting, yeah, you know, so... It's the purpose. I mean, we we want to do that. So it, it's really um, open and free for you to share your stories. So unlimited, but unlimited. <laughs> okay. <laughs> unlimited, what, free Wi-Fi? <laughs> but unlimited. Okay. Yeah, so that's, that's cool. And then... um. Yeah, keep keep those coming. We're excited. We'll figure it out as we go. Like we said, this is a very, very new idea. Mm -hmm. um, we have to align our whole team and we have to align everything as well. So mm -hmm. it's okay. It's okay. We have time. And there will be a dis uh, um, explanation about how to write or like um, like for some examples. So mm -hmm. um, yeah, we'll get we'll we'll draft something up. Okay. Yeah. All right. I think I think uh, that's it for the announcement today. But we should definitely. We we came here for the AMA. We want to do the AMA. Um, if you so, Jeff, if you could come in, uh, moderate mm -hmm. us with the AMA, that would be great. Yes, Thank you fantastic. Super super excited for this announcement. I know that everybody in the server as well is super excited. We have so many people chatting right now that uh, the chat channels are actually frozen right now from so many people chatting. Uh, drop a drop a black rose in the chat if you're excited about this idea. I want to see how many people are excited here. Oh okay, look at look at all those black roses. That's that's incredible. Wow. So, where is this chat is happening? Uh, general. Okay, oh. general. <laughs> so there you go. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was no no I was look generals up here. You 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 also look what? General. I was in general. Oh, you were in general. Yeah, yeah. it's it frozen. That's oh, that's why. Yeah. Cool. 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 Yep, chat's freezing a little bit. So. Um, as far as the heal project goes, the team will update. Uh, I'll keep everybody in the Discord updated as I'm fed information, and we'll make sure that that's a super awesome event. Like I mentioned, it's been a long time coming, so we want to make sure that we give the Black Roses a super awesome opportunity to uh, connect with the band themselves. So um, is everybody ready to get the Q&A session started? Is everybody ready in the uh, office there? Yes, sir. We are. Super <clears throat> cool. So let's start off with the first question from Star Lost. And she asks, uh, your music helps bring smiles to people's faces when they need positive energy in their lives. So what brings a smile to your faces or what helps you uh, lift your spirits when you all need positive energy in your lives? You. Yeah. You. Mm, uh, it, it could be a really easy answer, but it is. Really. <laughs> yeah, that's right. No, it's the obvious one, but it is. What helps to lift your spirit when you need positive energy in your life? <laughs> music. Well, yeah, music and our fans and food. The, the, the members. The, the uh, members and the an anticipation of us releasing a new album, anticipation of us standing on a stage. Yes. Rice. <laughs> Hanging out. <laughs> Hanging out. Oh. <laughs> uh, um, whiskey. Yeah. Um, whiskey. Yeah. Some foods. Oh, cool. <laughs> Main things. Spicy. Yeah. That, okay. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Uh, so moving on to a uh, second question. Um, <laughs> So what part of the city or world are you most looking forward to performing in when you start touring again? Oh, oh. We're, we're going all parts because we're going everywhere. Yeah. Mm. 
all the cities that we've been, we want to revisit again because we want to, you know, refill the, the feeling that we felt. And all the new cities, <laughs> we are so excited to feel the new feelings. Yeah. We're actually, uh, we're actually in the process of fixing the cities, cities. that we're going to. Mm -hmm. Whatever makes the most sense and most cities we could hit, we want to hit. We're doing a really long tour this round. Um, and we're doing it so then we could come meet the most, uh, most people that we can. Uh, you know, we, we are at four bodies. Mm -hmm. We wish we had more, but mm -hmm. you know, we're trying to make it so that we could hit, you know, as many cities as, as possible. Yeah. And yeah. We'll, we'll announce it soon. Very soon. Very soon. So stay tuned. Yay. Fantastic. That sounds great. Um, the next question is from Mariana, and she asks, do you guys have any fear or phobia about the path that you're taking within music? And what do you consider your biggest flaw to be, if any? like my phobia is spiders. Yeah. Spider? But oh, spider. But but in terms of like music, like, I don't think we're really scared or afraid of what's uh, gonna happen mm. as long as we're together. Um, meaning the members, the company, you guys. Uh, if we're if we all just have one purpose, one goal, I don't I don't think there's anything to be scared about. Yeah. Um. But yeah, my personal phobia is spiders. Yeah. Mm. Oh, don't let me get well. Um. Dylan's nothing afraid of. He's actually even more scary. Dylan is really? just scary. Yeah, he, he's a scary human. <laughs> yeah. I, mean, I don't know what the process of his um, brain is going through. <laughs> no, I'm no normal. <laughs> Very normal. <laughs> um, I was really afraid of dark when I was really... Um, like a child, but not anymore. But when I feel like that, I'm like really, um, like haunted, mm -hmm. like just just by myself. When mm -hmm. I'm in the dark and feel haunted, yeah. then I I get like really nervous, and and really so you're afraid of the so dark. <gasps> and then I really want to go to somewhere where people are, you know, when people are. Yeah, people are. So you're uh, afraid of being alone in the dark. True. Okay. Mm -hmm. That sounds about right. What about you? Um, I don't know. It's a little bit different. Mm -hmm. Okay. Like, uh, for me, mm -hmm. lost my weight. It, weight? Yeah, yeah. No, no. Weight. 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 Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. So you don't know what to do. Yes. In, in the future? Like, sometimes I'm afraid of, like, lost my weight. What can I do? What am I doing uh -huh. now? Who I am. Oh, so yeah. I identity. I don't know. Yeah, just losing think, losing purpose. I think. Just mm, yeah. yeah. losing purpose and like. Don't worry, that won't happen to me. Mm, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> wow. For sure. Well, I can say on behalf of the Black Roses that we have uh, one hundred percent confidence in your path that you all are taking in music, and we all definitely think that uh, it's very brave what you're doing in music, and we. Really appreciate and love it so so much for sure. Yes, yeah, and we are really happy of uh, what's happening right now, and we no, but it's our path, right? We're walking all together, so for sure, know, for sure. Even with, our friends and even with you, Jeff, that's why that's why we won't lose the path because so many people are walking the same way. Yay! Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Uh, let's move on to the next question from Andy, and Andy asks, "Can you give us the origin story behind quote unquote?" Uh, Black Rose. Where did that come from? What is the inspiration for it? Uh, any context behind that? Do you guys remember those song? The song of Black, Black, Black Rose. Rose. Yes, Black Rose. The song. Of course. Yeah. yeah. The origin is Black Rose. Yeah. Our fans. Yeah. Mm -hmm. we, we wrote it um, before the members went to the army, and we wrote it as a reminder and as a promise that we will come back. Yep. Mm -hmm. um, just needed some time. To align everything and yeah, uh, it's, it was basically about we were thinking of 
our promise, our, our path that we were going to take. But it was just the fact that we had to like take a, take a breather uh, mm -hmm. and rest. Yeah. Stop walking for a little bit. Yeah, and I remember that uh, leading up to writing the bank notes, mm -hmm. we, we had a hard time and yeah. we want to mm. send a message to our yeah. fans and we want to tell to our fans like thankful mm -hmm. yeah. and then all of my members has the same thinking yes like the title of the song is blank mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Mm. that was the like yeah yeah all of we wanted to yeah just say thank you yeah. basically just, yeah yeah and and like you said naturally the title of the song we just it, we all all of us for it just went like let's do it yeah. black rose yeah, yeah. And, and and in terms of like the black rose meaning as a fandom name um mm -hmm. in korea uh black rose it, it means like protecting mm -hmm. protecting um and it means like uh what are you doing uh, like it's like protecting and getting protected like a black rose if if you're the black rose mm -hmm. you protect and you you protect the other person mm -hmm. and it's, so basically we're protecting each other yay yeah that's what it means yes the song actually have that message in it as well Course. Yeah. Yep. Mm. Awesome. Well, there you go. It just makes the Black Rose that much more meaningful. Uh, we have a next question from Lupe. I hope that I'm not butchering the name there. Um, and they ask, what kind of music styles would you like to incorporate more in the future uh, along with pop? Rock. Ooh. Everything. Yes. Opera. <laughs> Metal. <laughs> um, um, electronic. Um, yeah, it wouldn't really matter what music style, because like it will still be our tone. I think that's what we care about the most. And uh, we already, I feel like the rose already has a tone that we are all aligned on. Mm -hmm. And even if it's pop, even if it's you know hip hop, even if it was rock or anything, it would still be the rose tone. And so, yeah. yeah, it will be something like the rose. So yeah, yeah, you'll know it's the rose. <clears throat> Definitely. Awesome. Uh, the next question comes from Molly, and she asks, what artists do you take inspiration from when you create a music or you create a track or get inspired by a track? Well, I don't think we have like one particular artist uh, we just take everything from. Mm -hmm. yeah. And it's, it's just like, yeah. Oh, yeah. We yeah, just—it's like different per like song, different per like, per, like season or like where you're currently listening. What you are currently listening to? Yeah, something. And rather than artists, I think it's more of like we get in because there's four of us, mm -hmm. and when we do a uh, writing sessions, it's just like we get inspired by each other and what what our experiences were mm -hmm. and the sounds that we were kind of had in mind. And yeah, what we are like, you know, playing along, mm -hmm. and we just have that. Then come it, it just pops up, oh. yeah, mm. and then we just talk about it, because mm. because each of us, you know, Jaehyung is his own artist, Dylan Hajin is his own artist, mm. Leo and of Tojin is his own artist, and me as well. So I think we get inspired by each other, and we try to create sounds. Um, we try to explain what we're hearing in our heads, and we uh, all agree, and that's when the song comes out. Every time's a collaboration, mm. yeah. And it's the and the, the the final um result result is the rose. So we really like the process. How we do it like this. <laughs> it's kind of like a culmination of a lot of different ideas and textures and influences from a lot of artists that sort of make the unique sound that the rose produces, which is very awesome. Basically, um, yes. So we have a question from Mew, and Mew asks, um, a lot of things have happened over the past two and a half years in the world. Uh, could you give some words of encouragement for the Black Roses in Korea waiting for you uh, for the Seoul Showcase coming up? War, words, words of, of encouragement? Encouragement. Um, wow. We want to have that in the song of the song that we are trying to work on right now. And 
Uh, what was the question again? Sorry. So, like, you know, past two and a half years, um, there were a, a lot of um, um, crazy thing happening. Mm -hmm. So, um, they just want a um, few words or sentences for uh, encouragement. Just, just. Oh, for Korea? Uh, no, 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 for Black Roses. Oh, for Black Roses. Our Black Roses. Um, fighting. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all right. Well, you can't do it. Uh, we just want yes. to say that we're we're with this, and we want to have that thing. Uh, no, we want to do that with music. That's what we want to say. Mm -hmm. yeah. Very cool. Uh, the next question comes from Sarah Jean, and she asks. Do you have any idea on when we will have any information on the tour dates for the rows or any further information regarding that? Uh, yes, we have an idea. I don't want to say it because the date might change. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely do want to say it, but I can't say it. Mm. I shouldn't say it, right? Mm -hmm. but I should just say it. No, because <laughs> no, it's going to change. Yeah, we're, we're figuring it out. We're, we're but, really going to do a long one. Yeah. That's for sure. Mm. And uh like before this year ends mm -hmm. um we will start the tour for sure oh yeah for sure yeah. Way so before. way before so yeah yeah soon near future you, you, you guys don't have to yeah. wait that long it's coming up it's like, very it's, it's already half of the year and you know we said that we're gonna start a tour this year so um, yeah yeah feel my fun <laughs> All positive news for the Black Roses. That's awesome to hear. Uh, the next question comes from Hano Jiangmi, and she asks, "Do you have any events planned?" You. We're actually going to be together. We're going to be um, in a studio in the desert. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we'll we'll celebrate there. Maybe we'll try to uh, organize like a quick like discord event we could do like a get together like this and we could kind of uh kind of all hang out for a little bit and we'll figure it out but yes we should do something mm. it's it's going to be a little bit personal plan for our group but yes yeah it's a, it's anniversary so we should definitely yeah you know, we'll try to yeah let's try to draft up like if we could like stream or something yeah yeah, yeah well uh so we could kind of hang out do a little fifth year anniversary party mm. that would be perfect Awesome. Well, everybody in the chat, make sure to look forward to that for sure. Uh, that sounds very, very cool. The mm. next question comes yeah, from... Cool. Oh, go ahead. Oh, no, 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 no. I was oh, just like... sorry. I just had a little delay there. My bad. Um, the next question comes from Reverie, and Reverie asks, at what moment did each of you know that you wanted to become a musician? If you have any sort of definitive moment, or if it was sort of a progressive type of thing, do you have any significant moment in your lives? Ooh. When I was born. <laughs> Yours. You were yeah. born? Born to be a musician. Okay. 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 You came out to the world yes. <laughs> saying that I'm gonna be a drummer. Yeah. I'm gonna be a singer. I'm gonna be an, an, an artist, musician. Yes. Yeah. Actually, well, I was a child. Right? Uh, like maybe six years old. Six grade. Oh, yes. Six grade. No, six years old. Six years old. Seven years old. Yeah, you, right? you were six years old. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. I listened to songs um in um what i gonna say at that age when at like, that age yeah baby. when you were yeah. baby oh, no, like, <laughs> okay <laughs> I, I i listened to pop music oh wow. yeah Whoa. do you remember what song uh yeah uh i remember the, the <laughs> mel melody like yeah tea <laughs> you know yeti yeah, it? it's like disco. Oh, it's like disco. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, he's lying. Yeah. Since <laughs> my you just made that. Since <laughs> my <laughs> since my father liked uh, pop music, yeah. So mm. yeah, I listen to them. 
That's actually very important though. When you yeah. listen to like music at a very young age, like mm-hmm. that's mess with you in your like subconscious. Yeah. 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 I had a moment. I had a moment when I was twenty, like late twenty. Yeah. I was studying to go to a good university, and then late twenty. You mean early twenty? Late twenty. Late twenty. I mean, I mean, I mean, <laughs> when I was 20, no, late 20 like, right like, <laughs> okay, uh, when I was 20, like, oh, in, in, in 20, the age of 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, like, really, and yes, it's 21, for the, um, um, um <laughs> translation, okay, yeah, and I was studying to go t- uh, to a university, and then, um, I was listening to, um, one of the primary songs, actually. Oh, really? Oh. Yeah. The Korean, uh, the Korean artist. Yeah. And I just, it, it just came up that I cut to my mind like, fuck, 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 fuck. Uh, oh, uh, oh, can umak I really wanted to do it, like when I was really a, a, a kid as well. Yeah. But I didn't have the courage to do it. Right, right. Uh, I I want to do music. What should I do with music? Like, yeah. like you know, specific, like, um, like. A composer or a singer or like a, you know but i just wanted to like ah, ah, ah. but when i was listening to that and i was actually studying i i went ah. oh and leo, leo was actually very smart and he was a he was like very good in school but like that was a lot you know he already had plans for like yeah. college and the future but he just quit and he decided to do music. Mm. Do you regret it? <laughs> Never. It's my it's my um life job. Yeah. No, honestly, I'm glad you quit studying. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> is, it, is that a compliment? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> good thing. Okay. Right? You all agree. Yeah. yeah. Cool. What about what yeah. about you? Is is there like fuck? fuck. No, there I, there really isn't a fuck. I think for me it was more like situation. Or, uh, you know, I I I went out in the show called K-pop Star, and yeah. that's the it was like it wasn't a joke going out, but I did not take it seriously, honestly. Mm-hmm. And um, as the rounds progressed, and as I kept going, <laughs> kept going in the rounds, I I did I did feel like that was something I could do and I wanted to do. And then I think it for me it like it has to build up, like it has to make sense like throughout, and I have to see it, I have to feel it, so. That's that's the time when I wanted to. Yeah. Yeah. And you felt it, and you went along I, with it, yeah. and I was on stage, and I and I realized that it was such a beautiful uh, experience. Yeah. And like likewise, yeah, great. Yeah, thank yeah. you for doing that. <laughs> <laughs> what about Jeff? Um, when we played mm-hmm. like we used to, oh, oh yeah. we kept them. Yes, us four. Yeah, yeah. us four. Yeah. It's our first uh, song. Practice. Oh, yeah, practice. Yeah. yeah. Assemble. Oh, that was a moment. Yeah, that yeah. was a moment. That, that moment, that, uh, so the first time we played together, it was for a show. Leo asked me uh, if, we could, if I could do the show with him, a show with the band. Uh, and then we got into this home practice room, right? Mm-hmm. Yes. And we decided to play the song called uh, Like We Used To by Rocket to the Moon. Mm-hmm. And they told me the chorus, it was like F. Right? Yeah. <laughs> they told me to just play like F, G, I don't remember. Mm-hmm. But when, the first time we all like came in together and the sound like drums were coming out, bass was coming out, uh, Leo's guitar was coming out, my guitar was coming out. That's like that time I really, that was a moment I realized too. Yeah. Uh, that's when I realized that we should do this together. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 We always say this, yeah. we always say this, but like it wasn't that great actually. We probably yeah. should have yeah. <laughs> I I, I, Well, it, it wasn't. It was just really, really simple chords and simple like um, um strokes. Yeah. But yeah, when we all made the sound, we instantly felt yeah. that this is it. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure if like every anybody else was there listening to it from the outside, they, were they like, would go, oh, "What the hell? <laughs> not that great." But to us, it was like four of us. It was it was great. <laughs> yeah. It, the, my ears were like, mm. "What is going on?" Mm. Yeah. The energy was there. Yeah, I'm not kidding. I'm I'm not joking. I I really felt that. Yeah, we always we we felt it all together. Mm. Yay! Cool. Cool. Yep. Can I ask a question? Oh yeah. Oh. Um, Hajun's got a question. To who? Uh, to, uh, to you guys. Oh, oh yeah, to, yeah, to yeah. us. Yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. 
Hold up. <laughs> oh, please, please do it. I think I gotta go to toilet. <laughs> okay, yeah. how many questions do we have left? Oh, uh, can you repeat that, please? Uh, so Hanjun has a question, and uh, he needs to go to the toilet. But yeah, I was wondering how many questions we have left. Oh, oh, no problem. Tell him to take his time. We have four questions left, and then maybe you can take one or two from general chat. Uh, cool. Okay, okay, go ahead. Yeah. Sorry, Kato Senpai. <laughs> okay, I'll come just, back quickly. Okay, Hanjun's not here. Um, this is the right time. This is the time where we could say some. Ah, nah. Where we could talk shit about yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's, let's move on with the next questions, Jeff. Sure. Do you want me to go to the next question, then you guys can start on it? Yes, please. Yes. Awesome. So we have the next question from Donbop, and Donbop asks, are there any plans to experiment with each member's voice or instrument solos on the upcoming album? Ooh, actually, we, we did talk about this. Mm -hmm. um, and... Uh, there will be because the simple answer is yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and um, it will be really uh, we like to experiment um a lot. So the great thing about the rose is that um all four members know how to sing, and uh that's I th I feel like that's one of our biggest like perks. Um, we're almost like a cappella but with instruments. Right? Yay! Mm -hmm. So then um yes definitely for each song for each different song uh. With the meaning, with however it fits, we are going to incorporate uh, other, like all vocals. Mm -hmm. And yeah, it's, yeah, in terms of like guitar solos, though, it's just that I, I'm just, I just, I'm not a great guitar player and I don't like doing solos. No, you can't. Um, so then no. if Leo wants to do it, he could do a guitar solo. <laughs> well, we could all do it together. Anyway, what? Okay, sorry. Um, um, yes, uh, we even actually like experiment like. We we even make our voice to be instruments as well. Like you know, there's sampling, and like there's um all other um ways to do it. So we are really um experimental. Okay, Hajun's back. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'm back. Comfortable now. Hajun <laughs> in the chat. Drop some Hajun stickers in the chat. Make him feel welcome <laughs> from the bathroom break. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> Hajuni. Hajuni? Yeah, Hajuni. How can we tell? You go Hajuni. Yes, Hajun. She's Hajuni boys. Thank you for the awesome. sticker. There's so stickers. many stickers. Yeah. All the Hajun stickers. <laughs> and just a quick shout out to all the artists that we have in the server. You all do a great job of making stickers of the four members. We really appreciate your effort doing that. Um, yeah. Stickers are so amazing. Super cool, super cool. Um, let's move on to uh, Unji8715's question, and they ask, uh, could you give any type of insight into the future plans of the Rose uh, on top of any sort of announcements that you've made today? Are there, are there any other kind of breadcrumbs that you can feed us today? You're like, we fed you like a whole bread. <laughs> Um, I'd have to yeah. agree that it was like a whole loaf of bread, wasn't it? <laughs> For yeah, sure. Um, loaf of bread, actually. What? Okay. But basically, uh, like like we said, like definitely look out for those announcements with exact dates. However, like tour, yes. Um, album, yes. Uh, mm. live performances, yes. yes. Mm -hmm. Many many content, yes. Photo, mm -hmm. video, photos, yeah, and like, magazine. Yeah. I don't know if there's any. That we could do, we would love to. Yeah, we'll really consider this. Yeah, there's a lot happening, mm -hmm. but they'll happen. So, like, well, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, sure, fair enough. Um, the next question is from Yuffie, and Yuffie asks, "Do you guys have anything that you like to collect? An example would be coins or books or something like that." Ooh. Oh, huh? Leo, do you have something you collect? Alcohol? Yeah. <laughs> you know, collects these like, small, you know, the small bottle alcohols. Well, not only small ones. I That's have like right. Yeah, cause every time I go um to a different city, I if I can, I try to bring a lot of um alcohol, as many bottles as possible. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Well, but, only one bottle. Yeah, only <laughs> one bottle is allowed when you go out. That's why he country. makes us bring it. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> And apart from alcohol, what about what about you guys? Like to collect. Um, I don't, I don't collect. Yeah, he doesn't really collect, collect yeah. something, but, but I want collect something. LP. Oh, LPs. Yeah, yeah. Mm, yeah, that could be one. Yeah. yeah, I have one. It's a Coldplay LP. Mm -hmm. And you like it? Yeah, I like it. Right. But I have just one, so. Um, I want many more, more. Okay, LP. <laughs> I was collecting the shoes. Yeah, you know yeah, that? yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, shoes. Shoes. yeah. I love shoes. But I don't know. This is I don't. Know, I don't yeah. collect any any yeah, yeah. not anymore. Yeah, yeah, I think yeah. Maybe you will collect something in the future. Yeah, and when you do, please tell us. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, I I lost all my collection. I had many LPs. I had the, the script signature LP, Ooh. play signature LP, all that. It's all gone. Um, I was collecting shoes, but I sold it. Mm. I needed to live, and then I collected like uh, Legos. Mm -hmm. Lost all that. Mm. Yeah, so I'm not collecting anything right now. What's happening to you? Like, oh, yeah, awesome. I never got to clean out the room and then now mm -hmm. it's all gone and it's sad. I'm actually very sad about it. Yeah. <laughs> but you know, when you when then you have um free uh spaces to collect more. Yeah. From now on. Yeah, I uh, yeah. Next question. <laughs> <laughs> Great timing. Great timing. Yeah. <laughs> so the the final question of the curated questions comes from Jess Box, and Jess Box wants to know. Uh, dating back to the 1960s, who is your favorite artist or group? If you had to pick one, I think we can. I can. We. I think we can say this like at one. Uh, like, well, 동시에 같이 말할 수 말해도 될것 같아. 해봐. Call it up. Okay. 3, 2, 3, 2, 1. The Beatles. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> great choice. Great choice. Super influential band, just like the Rose. Fits like a glove, mm -hmm. right? Um, so I'll just I'll just add on to that question before we kind of get into the uh, general chat and take one or two questions. So, what would be the main reason that the Beatles speak to the Rose members so much? What is the main reason for the influence? So, like more than the music itself, I think the Beatles has a good representation of uh, each member uh, showing their own charismatic um, self, and each member is very different. And when we, you know, created the Rose together, all four members, we, that's what, that was basically our main theme. We, we felt that each of us were different musicians that were playing different uh, instruments and each of us had a very different style, but um, we really wanted that to show like the individuality of like Hajun, Jaehyung, uh, Tojun and myself. And they really, I think they're the only band till this day where I could confidently say that we know each member and how different they were. And, but, but, but with that, they came together and became the Beatles and that was a whole another thing. And that's what we, I think that's what we are. Even, even before, you know, um, we decided like that, that really fit the image of Beatles. Like we, that's how we felt. And uh, what, what really clicked us to the Beatles was when we were watching the documentaries, we saw how they were and we saw the, uh, uh, the problems they had, the conflicts they were going through. And we could just relate so much as um, just us living and trying to do the roast. Yeah. At yeah. first, when we like got together and then said, let's do a band, let's form a band. It wasn't the Beatles at first. Yeah, but, was... Like as, as we were going along, I mean, yeah, that's when we... Realized, Thought, yeah. realized that um actually Beatles have a lot of similar and um factor and matters that we have so that's why we um love Beatles so much and and of course um music as well but like, apart from music the other um factors for they, sure they, yeah. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Do you would you all like to pick uh, questions yourself out of general? Would you like me to curate them for you? Hmm. Uh, we'll go through the questions yeah. and then see what 
black roses are currently talking, questioning. Awesome. So everybody that is listening in, go to the general chat and make sure that you put a ton of effort because they're only going to take a few questions here. Make sure that, oh, wow, they already have them. Oh, God. They already have them already. Um, make sure that you put a lot of effort into the question, make it unique, and they will be picking out their uh, favorite one or two and answering them. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so good looking with the new pictures that yes. took. Well, uh, I'll, I'll ask on behalf of. <laughs> um, wow. <laughs> so, oh, rice stick, please. Yes. So, yes. We want to do awesome. light stick for sure. Yes. We've been wanting to do like a 3D light stick. It is perfect. With the rose, you could do so many things. Mm. We have so many design ideas and yeah. And like, yeah, that's that's something we should definitely make on. It's something to have this light stick um yeah. like as a possession, you know? As a collection as collection, well. Collection, yeah. Maybe I'll collect that. <laughs> Maybe I'll stick. have that in my room too. Yeah. Did you did you see the stick that Ben made? Oh, the fan? Yeah, 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 the design. designs, yeah. yeah. It, it was, was like similar to like what we had thought, like in the bottle, there's a rose. Yeah. And it's like, yeah, and it changes color. Like, yeah, like, I mean, like, honestly, maybe we should do like a. Never mind. Good one. <laughs> yeah, good one. But yes, yeah, light sticks. Let's do light sticks. Yes. Yeah. Baby. What is your Starbucks order? Mine is Ice Americano. What is yours? Um. Um, I usually go for um iced chocolate. Iced chocolate. Okay. You know the frappuccino? No, the dragon fruit. Like the sangnu? I mean, uh, yungbang. 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 Yeah. dragon fruit. Fresh, uh, Passion fresh? fruit? No, the dragon fruit juice. It's not like exist in Korea. It doesn't uh, exist. It doesn't okay. exist. I don't the, the anyway something with yeah. dragon fruit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Dragon fruit. Starbucks come more. Ah. True chicken and one pig. Just. Oh, American. Yeah. Uh, I see. I see. Yeah. Yeah. Dragon fruit acai. Acai. Yeah. Acai. Yeah. Acai bowl. So will there be physical copies of the album plus light sticks? Oh yeah. Yay. Yeah. I say yes and then that's everybody else's responsibility to figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, physical copies, we should, definitely we are thinking of physical copies. Um mm -hmm. light sticks, like I want I wanna do them personally. Mm. Yeah. Can we expect photo cards for the next album? Yeah, if we have physical albums, mm -hmm. definitely there will be photo cards. Yes. yes. Okay. Oh. Um, never... oh. What's the most stressful part of the process of producing a song together? That's cool. Um, arguing. Arguing. <laughs> 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 like one word. Yeah. <laughs> like one yeah. word. Um, it takes long time. <laughs> 재영 오빠 영어 실력 진짜 많이 늘었네요. 많이 했었던가 봐요. 그 얘기 줘요. 예, 네. 나만 so so much better at English. Nice. <laughs> it's for you guys. Yeah. It's are they taking? You know, they're both going taking English lessons like at, like twice a week. Mm. Yeah. You know, going to academy and stuff. Uh, you know, so we could conversate more together. So. <laughs> Thank you. 오빠들 버스킹 할 생각 있나요? Oh. 버스킹 너무 재밌죠. We really want to. It. 너무 yeah. 재밌죠. Yeah. 언제 어디서 할지는 모르겠는데. <laughs> Yes. Yeah. What's yeah. going on? We actually want to like hit these smaller venues, like like yeah. go back to our Choshin and then yeah. post King Yeah. Oh, and we 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 uh, I think we had something idea like glamping, mm. post King. Oh yeah. Yeah. Mm, well, 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 when we were glamping, yeah. we we even talked about yeah. How we talked about um doing buskings. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so one or two more, and then we could, you know. Yeah. 
We are so thankful for all your efforts in learning English. Okay. Um, cool. Two more, you said? One or two, one or two. I can't, I just can't read it. This question in the chat. Oh. And also thank all the members for coming in. I know that their time is very valuable, so make sure that you drop a black rose and a heart and make sure that you thank all the members. We will take one or two more questions and then we will wrap things up here. Uh, can you, will photographer Greed or OMG be in the album? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> those songs may never be in an album, but those songs are definitely, if anyone wants to buy them. <laughs> um, no, but definitely we, uh, we know those songs exist. Uh, I think it's just, you know, we wrote those songs such a long time ago. I think uh, we kind of, the timing, uh, you know. Sunday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sunday. 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 If it go, if it does go along well, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. They said, please have a lot of albums available because they can't get their hands on on the old albums that we. Okay, so, okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, actually, it would, yeah, good I don't to even know, have good them. To know. I I can't even get my hands on them either. Yeah, they're all, they're all sold out. Oh yeah, and it's not producing anymore. No, it's not. Oh, cool. Can we expect to come back anytime soon? Yep. Yep. Where were you the whole yeah, whole, the whole whole time? time. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we've been talking about. Yeah. The whole t this whole time. Is your is your speaker working? Oh. <laughs> no, yeah, yes, but yes, come come back very soon. Uh, we'll have the date announced hopefully soon. Mm. Yeah. Cool. I want to ask the Black Roses really quick. If you want the Roses to come back soon for a third AMA, and you want them to come on to Discord again and make sure that they uh, talk to you guys. If you guys want them to come back, drop some hearts in the chat. I want to see how many people want them to come back here. Yes, yes. Right. All right. It was a thank you, Jeff, for moderating. Thank you. Thank you so much for your time. I really appreciate it. This yeah. has been super awesome. I know that the announcements today um, have been super uh, large. I know that they've been uh, on the way for some time, and I know that all of you are super excited to make the comeback and uh, deliver to the Black Roses around the world. Yeah, thank you, Black Roses, for coming in. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Talk to you very soon again. Thank you so much, guys. So that wraps up uh, AMA number two. I'll let them say their goodbyes really quick, and then we will transition over to an after party. So uh, thank you guys once again. One final goodbye. Uh, drop some hearts in the chat, and I will come back in about 30 seconds. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Annyeong. Bye. Bye Submit your stories. Exist. All right. So that concludes the Rose AMA number two. Thank you so much to the English transcription team. Thank you so much to Eleni. I know that she's sort of, sort of the, the one person team doing all of the Korean transcription, doing a fantastic job. So we definitely want to make sure that we show them all love, uh, make sure that we show them that we appreciate their efforts.